Hey everybody, Jill Seal here with Lighting Solutions. Today I want to talk about the Lighting Exchange. The Lighting Exchange is a really cool tool that we like to use for to search for current light fixtures and to build visual submittals for projects. It's also great to share back and forth um, on different ideas of fixtures that might work for you and your project. So I am going to run through a, just a couple ways that I like to use the Lighting Exchange. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out. To get started on the Lighting Exchange, you will need an invitation. So just let us know and we can send you an invite and then it will prompt you to create a username and password. Okay, I am gonna get started. I have the Lighting Exchange open in my background. This is the dashboard. Um, it also has a resource center. Right here you can see it highlights new arrivals. Um, if you need CEUs, sometimes they're listed here as well. So the dashboard is pretty helpful, but the line card is where you will search for fixtures. The quick search is awesome if you know um, the name of the product. So maybe we were in and we were just talking about the floss infrastructure and you wanna save that. So if you type in the name floss infrastructure, I started to type, you can see that pop up right here. So maybe this is something that you loved and you just wanna like keep it in your mind so that you can use it on the next possible project. So you can go ahead and hit that little heart there and it will save it to your favorites. That way you can just um, store it in your quote unquote memory bank and you'll have it there to apply to your next project. The next way to search is manufacturer search. So over here on the left side, you click manufacturer search and you can scroll down here and it lists all of our manufacturers. So here you can search, um, again by manufacturer and I'm just looking. So maybe tech lighting is your favorite. This lists just some of the fixtures that are um, here in the lighting exchange and it breaks it down by type. So you would just click on your type and it would expand your search. So that is one way if maybe you have a favorite manufacturer you know you wanna use on a project, you would search by manufacturer. Product search is a way that I use this all of the time. So perhaps you are looking for a bollard for um, exterior lighting. You can click your light fixture type and then scroll down and it will give you all of our bollard options. So that is how you would do that. Um, obviously you can see lots of different options here. Um, and then there's an application search with application videos or pictures. Um, next, I wanna show you that you can create projects. This is great. So if maybe you said that you were looking for a wall sconce, maybe I created a project um, in lighting ex the Lighting Exchange and sent you a few options of sconces. So let's go in here and I'm gonna show you an example of a project that we worked on. This one is great, it has um, the budget that is worked in. So pricing was included, the specifier went in and included a base budget and that they can see here on the pie chart exactly where they're spending their dollars. Um, and then you can kind of create like a visual submittal package. So here, classrooms, administrative, kitchen, and then the fixtures are saved under that type. Um, here on the very far right hand corner under status, you can see a drop down and it says approved, declined, or pending. So perhaps um, you and I were working on this together. We created the classroom type and I entered a few different um, suspended linear fixtures. You can go then go in and approve the fixtures you like, decline the fixtures you don't like. We can clean it up a bit um, and add pricing in for the ones that you like or um, just have a few options hang out. So that is a really, a really great um, option there. We can go ahead and build a traditional submittal package for you based on the fixtures that you approve too. So I am going to show you how we can start a project and save some fixtures to it. Okay, so you would go to projects 
And then it wants you to choose, let me move over here, it wants you to choose active archived or templates. So you would go here and you hit start new project. And let's call it lighting exchange sample. Okay. I'm going to show you how to add a fixture and a type to your project. So add, let's say we are working on a school, type in classroom, that is your type. It assigns it a color. Um, the type is classroom. We can add notes in here. We can include pricing. Um, and then you would go ahead and add fixtures. There's a few different ways to use this. It's really user friendly. Um, one way is to create your type and then go here to add. And you can type in uh, a fixture that you would want to use in a classroom. So we've been using a lot of the Metalox Contractor Go-To Flat Panel. Uh, it's a really great product, high quality, um, and an awesome price. It's called the Contractor Go-To for a reason. So you can add that just like that. So there you are. We have added a flat panel um, to the classroom type. So here, let's do... Um, and I want some recessed uh, linear fixtures also on a budget. So I'm going to do another stock um, fixture that I love from Metalux. It's great pricing, um, has that sleek linear look to it, and I'm going to add it to the schedule here. So I have flat panels there in the classroom and I have some recessed linear lights in the hallway. So that is just how simple it is to use the lighting exchange. Um, you can share the project here. You can share it uh, with your, um, you can share it with me, you can share it with a specifier, an engineer. Um, I'm sure you can even share it with your end user. Um, if you wanna share it with, with us at Lighting Solutions, we can then go in and add options if you'd like. We can add pricing. Um, we can kind of walk through the project together. Um, so you would go to share project, enter an email. I'm gonna enter my email here. And then you would invite the user. So that is a little bit about the lighting exchange. I hope you'll reach out if you have any questions. I really, really enjoy this tool um, as a as somebody with a design background, it's really helpful to see things uh, visually versus um, sending emails back and forth with PDFs attached. It can kind of get a little bit um, confusing or messy or maybe we miss things. So it's nice to kind of see that whole package put together visually. Um, and yeah, I hope you enjoy this. Please don't hesitate to reach out with any questions.